king of kings can you go ahead and hallow the god of abraham isaac and jacob the covenant keeping god the god of all possibility the unchangeable changer that ruled in the changing world the unchangeable changer that ruled in the affairs of men can you open your mouth and just bless his holy name for counting you among the living this morning many slept last night and could not wake up this morning but here you are hale and hearty because the almighty god decided to count you among the living many are the battles uh, that god is fighting for you on a daily basis uh, many are the battles that the lord fought for you overnight uh, can you return all the glory can you show your gratitude to god and say lord i'm grateful lord i am grateful i am standing here this morning not by mind nor by power but by the spirit oh god uh, thank you for grace uh, brethren appreciate god you go out you return safely thank Thank you for joining mercy. You go out, you return safely. Thank you for protection. You go out, you return safely. Thank you for health. Can you lift up your voice and just appreciate him? Thank you for preservation. Thank you for protection. Thank you for good health. Thank you for prospering the work of your hand. Thank you for your home, your marriage, your family, your children. Just go ahead and appreciate your mighty God. Masuka Labate Kashandale. Zelebote Kasin Talima Mama Riata Kota Gazin Delay. Thank you for answer prayers at all time. Thank you because this morning your prayer will not go on answer. Just appreciate God. Just appreciate God. Thank him that even the rain could not hinder you. Even with the rain, you are still here. Give him glory because the Lord had great things in store for you. Masuko Labashan Alain. Thank you for what God is doing, even in His church. Thank you for what He's doing, even in this program. Thank you for our nation. Oh Lord, we are grateful. Father, Lord, we are grateful. May your name forever be praised. In Jesus' most wonderful name, we have worshiped. I thought the Lord God say better. Amen. Lift up your voice loud and clear and cry to the Almighty God. For the word of God it is written. He that covereth his sin shall not prosper, but whoso confesseth and forsaketh shall obtain mercy. Say, Father, say, Father, I confess all my inadequacy. I confess all my shortcomings before you. Lord, let me obtain mercy today. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God as you confess all your inadequacy? All your shortcomings. In any way, you must have come short of the glory of the Lord. Go ahead, humble yourself before God this morning that you may obtain mercy. Ask Him for mercy, for the mercy of the Lord prevail over judgment. Lord, we ask for your mercy. Almighty Father, we ask for your mercy. Mari Pokata, Shipulema Katuga Zindalia, Lebra Katuka Zindali. In Jesus' most wonderful name, we are praying. I tell someone who will say a better amen. Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 6. Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 6. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee to be a special people. Special people in the house shout hallelujah. Special people that will be receiving special blessing this morning. Make a joyful noise unto the Lord. Amen. God has chosen thee to be a special people unto himself. Above all people that are upon the face of the earth. You want to take five prayer points this morning. You will lift up your two hands and fire your first prayer room. And say, Father... You can do better. Say, Father, all the days of my life, let me live holy. Grant me grace to live holy because you are chosen me as a holy people. Lord, uphold me in holiness. Lord, uphold me in righteousness. Let me please you all the days of my life. Ah, my repa to Kazandale. Zabale baba 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 
Lord, your word is a sweet thing. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Daddy, let me forever be holy unto you. Lord, let me be holy unto you. Uphold me in righteousness and in holiness. In the name of Jesus. Maripo to Kasindala. Babo kate gazindelele. Promas kanda liga se katoli baba. And so shall it be in Jesus. Mighty name we are praying. He said, the Lord thy God has chosen thee to be special people unto himself. Lift up your hand and fire your second prayer arrow and say, Father, say, Father, let me ever be special in your hand. In all ramification, on every side, make me special. Make my destiny special. Make my family special. Make everything pertaining to me special. Go ahead and talk to the Almighty God. Oh, Marika Kakaba Shandale, Garipo Tagazanda Baba, Rakoto Gazinda Le Makuta Gaya, Bake Kasuta Le Pukutuliande, Limbrande Gazunta Limama. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Special people are entitled to, to special blessing. Lift up your two hands to heaven and say, My father, my father, my father. You are the one that have made me special. Therefore, oh God, release your special blessings unto me. In the name of Jesus. Can you go ahead and ask for special blessings? Special blessings from the most high. Special blessings, special blessings, special blessings from God this morning. Let God give you special blessings, special spiritual blessings, special financial blessings, special material blessings, special marital blessings, special blessings upon your business. Lord, release special blessings to us today. Ah, you are the one that made us special. Lord, release special blessings. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus, most wonderful name, you shall receive special blessing. Then he says, Not only we have made you special, he said, Above all people that are upon the face of the earth, I decree concerning you today, you shall be above only and not be needed. Nothing will pull you down, no power will be able to sit upon you. Lift up your hand and say, Father. Lead me above all my enemy. Let me be forever above and not be need. In the name of Jesus, make me head on every side. Can you go ahead and touch the Almighty God that you shall forever be above, 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 above. Kakaba kutaya, zaba lekete kakuta yenda da. Zagayekete kasunto de prande kasinda liande. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Lord, let me be above. Lord, let me be above. Let me be above, O God. By your power, lead me above all my enemies. By your power, lead me above failure. Lead me above poverty. Lead me above lack. Lead me above household wickedness. Lead me above, 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 above. Ah, man, ripa pa 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 pa. She pale kasuatali. Si zegede gede kasuatali mama. Zapa ya leke tu gaza. Lin rebos kate. Daddy, lead us above. Lord, lead us above sickness. Lead us above diseases. Lord, lead us above afflictions. Masukala, brother, are you praying? Let God lead you above poverty and lack. Masiandalala, let God lead you above suffering. Masuke lebaku sanda, that is lift us above all the nations of the earth. Let us be lifted above. Masupa ya putala, rakoto pashandalale. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus, mighty name, you shall be above. Finally, lift up your two hands to heaven and say, Father, without you, I can do nothing. As I begin my day today, all that I will do 
Oh God, my Father, partner with me and take over. Take over, take over, take over my day. Take over my business. Take over my career. Take over, take over, take over my family. Lord, take over all that I will do today. I hand them all over to you. Daddy, take over, take over. Take over the affairs of my life. Oh, take over my guidance. Take over my leading. Oh, my rima, my kasiandala. Babo ye kakabalala. Hey, Lord, without you, I can do nothing. Therefore, Lord, take over. Take over and help me today. Take over and guide me. Take over and lead me. Kapale kasiandala. Broko to gazinda liba baba ba. Shimale kasunta ba. Zabalo koto gazindi. Nema lianda le kakuta. Daddy, my days are your hand. Take over, take over, take over. Take over and make this day beautiful for me. Lord, take over and make this day fruitful. Lord, take over and make this day joyful. Take over and make this day peaceful. Oh, Lord, take over. Take over and prosper the work of my hand. Lord, take over and perform wonders in my life. Ask God to take over. Ask God to take over your day. <laughs> If God take over your day, nothing shall work against you. All things will work in your favor. Cry to him this morning and say, Lord, take over my day. That all things may work in my favor. Marika Ka. When God take over, he will deliver you from all evil. Cry to him that whatever evil associated with today is not going to be your portion. For the Lord will take over. Oh, Marima Kasiandala. Boropa Kalinada. Let God be involved in the affairs of your life today. Masitalia. When God takes over, He takes error away from you. He takes mistakes away from you. Kapoto le bashin talibaba. Zekete gasun talima kashandale. Thank you, Father. In Jesus, most wonderful name, we are praying. And so, Daddy, you want to say good morning. Everlasting Father, we are grateful. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your loving kindness. Thank you for your caring. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for all the victory. Thank you for your provision. Thank you for preserving us. Lord, I set our thanks in the name of Jesus. That this morning, O oh God, Father, even as we come before you, Lord, may we obtain mercy in the name of Jesus. Daddy, unto you I commit everyone listening to me wherever they are right now. Lord, uphold us in righteousness and in holiness in the name of Jesus. Daddy, may we forever be holy people unto you in the name of Jesus. Gracious and everlasting Father, you that have chosen us and have made us special unto yourself. I pray for everyone under the influence of my voice. Lord, make us special in all ramifications in the name of Jesus. Oh, your home shall be special before God. Your marriage shall be special before God. Your businesses shall be special before God. Your destiny shall be special before God. In the mighty name of Jesus, may the almighty God release special blessings to you. Special spiritual blessings. Special material blessings. Special financial blessings. Special marital blessings. In the mighty name of Jesus, God will lead you above all your enemies. Lead you above situations. Lead you above circumstances. Lead you above lack. Above poverty. Above sickness. Above diseases. Above affliction. Above household weakness. Above witches and wizards. In the mighty name of Jesus. You shall be above only. You shall not be beneath. In the mighty name of Jesus. And as you hand over your day into the hands of the Lord, God will be involved in the affairs of your life. God will guide you today. God will lead you today. God will help you today. God will stand by you today. God will defend you today. God will fight your battle today. In the mighty name of Jesus. Anything contrary to the will of God for your life, let God destroy them in the name of Jesus. Wherever your enemy are waiting for you, they will wait in vain. Anyone planning anything evil against you, let God destroy them in the name of Jesus. You will not weep. You will not mourn. You will not sorrow. 
I declare this day your day of rejoicing. I declare this day a peaceful day for you. If only my God can hear your louder amen, today will be a fruitful day for you. Today you shall be marvelously blessed, marvelously held in the name of Jesus. And so shall it be. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. Lift up your right hand and say with me very quickly and say, Our God is awesome. He reigns in heaven and on earth. He has never failed. And he has never sorry, he has never failed. And he will never fail me. He has the power to do what he has promised. I will forever give God all the glory and thanksgiving and his praises shall never cease from my lips. I declare and I confess concerning me and my household that we shall be holy people unto the Lord. The almighty God shall be our God and we shall not serve any other God beside him. We have been chosen to be special unto the Lord. And we shall be special in everything. We have special grace, special blessings, special in greatness, and we shall enjoy special protection. We shall be specially favored, and we shall be specially loved. I declare, and I confess, that I'm special in the hand of the Lord God Almighty. Therefore, I shall be above only and not beneath. The enemy shall never reign nor rule over me. All the days of my life, I am the head and not the tail. I shall be above spiritually, financially, and materially. The Lord shall lift me continually higher and higher. Higher and higher. And nothing shall be able to bring me down. I declare and I proclaim that the cancer and the purpose of God for my life shall stand. And there shall be manifestation of every good thing that the Lord has spoken concerning my life. I will finish well. I will finish strong. My ending shall be far better than my beginning. I will not go to her. I will reign eternity. I will love the Lord. And I will serve the Lord all the days of my life. In Jesus' name. Last in the Holy Ghost for one minute. Masuka Payenda. Romoto Kaskateli Brande Kasinta Limama. Shamale Gazuta Pa Likakuta Gazandi Ripro Koto Gazita Le Mama Zazala Bato Kashinche Le Mama Kubrande Kete Gazinta Rakakuta La Boto Kashinda Liani Thank you, my dear Father. In Jesus' special name, we are praying. I thought you were able to than everybody. I thought you said that, Amen, eight powerful times. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, and go ahead and make a joyful noise unto the Lord. I say, make a joyful noise unto the Lord. If you know your prayers are answered, make a joyful noise unto the Lord. If you know your prayers are answered, celebrate this morning. I say, celebrate this morning. Amen and amen and amen. And I pray for only one person. You shall be marvelously blessed. And so shall it be. Let me sit there as we continue our series and encounter with the God of all possibility. I am praying for you. You will have that encounter this morning. I say you will have that encounter. This season, testimonies will follow you. Luke chapter 7, verse 11 to 16. 
had been our walking Bible passage. He says, and it came to pass the day after that he went to we city now. Good. That he went into a city called Nay, and many of his disciples went with him, and much people. Now when he came near to the gate of the city, behold, there was a dead man carried out, the only son of his mother, and she was a widow, and most people of the city was with her. And when the Lord saw her, he had compassion on her, and said unto her, Weep not. And he came and touched the bear. And he lit up your two hands this morning and said, Lord, touch me. Before I leave here today, Lord, touch me. And they that bear him stood still, and he began to speak. Sorry? And he said, Young man, I say unto thee, Do what? Arise. Any power holding you down, God will destroy that yoke in animal children. And he that was there sat up and began to speak. And he delivered him to his mother. Somebody will be delivered here today. And there came a fear on all, and they glorified God, saying that a great prophet is risen up among God, and that God had visited his people. Receive divine visitation today. Brethren, we started looking at this series on Tuesday, and we've been able to look at some lessons in this uh, Bible passage. Lessons like when you have an encounter with the God of all possibility, there is likelihood he will turn your sorrow to joy. And that's why I'm praying for somebody you will never have reason to sorrow again. And we told her that when you have an encounter with the God of all possibility, you are likely to hear good news. Glad tidings. Your ear will never hear even you this year. In the name of Jesus. And we told her that when you encounter this God of all possibility, their situations are reversed. Amen? And we remember telling her that there are many death situations that are worse than physical death. May you not die spiritually in the name of Jesus. And of course, yesterday, we told her that an encounter with the God of all possibility brings some level of deliverance. Just as we read that, and he delivered the boy into the hand of who? The mother. And we told her yesterday that when you encounter the God of all possibility, the deliverances you are likely to get, number one, is deliverance from the spirit of shame and reproach. Deliverance from where? Spirit of shame and reproach. And we told us why you must be delivered from the spirit of shame. Praise the Lord. Because even David prayed the prayer in Psalm 25 and 20, say, Oh, keep my soul and, and deliver me let me not be ashamed. You will never be put to shame. We told out that another deliverance that is likely is that you are delivered from the spirit of Mara. The spirit of Mara is the spirit of bitter life. Amen? And we are able to establish why is it spirit of Mara. And we discovered that what happened to the widow of Nain a woman also suffered that in the Old Testament called Naomi who lost the, father, the husband and two sons, praise the Lord and her name Naomi means pleasant and beautiful but when she returned back to Bethlehem Judah and they were calling her Naomi said no, this is no longer Naomi, this is now Mara, and we also told her that even in Egypt that the Egyptians made the life of the children of Israel, how bitter thought that God had to send Moses an encounter that God had with Moses or the encounter that Moses had with the God of all possibility brought deliverance from bitter life to the children of Israel. I still pray for you this morning in that name that is above every other name. God will not allow your life to be bitter. Anything that will make your life bitter, God will deliver you. 
the almighty God will pour sweetness into your life in the name of Jesus and we told her that she was delivered from the power of incessant losses from the power of what? incessant losses which is the power of the thief praise the Lord because we told her that the Bible says in the book of John 10, 10 that the thief cometh to do what? to steal, to kill and to destroy and when you look at this woman you will see that the spirit of thief has been ravaging her life sometimes ago the thief came took the husband away again the thief came again took the son away the thief came again took her joy away the thief came again took her peace away can I pray for you sir every power assigned to come and steal your joy let God destroy them any power assigned to steal your peace let God destroy them any power assigned to steal your children, to steal your husband, let God deliver you. You are saying amen, say loud and clear. You will never be victim of the spirit of thief in the name of Jesus. And I decree for someone that can say a louder amen. Incessant losses are over in your life. Oh, throughout this year and beyond, you will not lose anything vital anything vital to your life shall not be lost in your family no life shall be lost you are saying amen say it loud and clear then let's settle down for the little thing we will share this morning and then we go into the laying of hands brethren and an encounter with the God of all possibility deliver you from the spirit of depression. Amen? From the spirit of what? Depression and spirit of heavy heart or heaviness. Praise the Lord. Brethren, when a man is depressed, you will discover that emotionally you are traumatized. Emotionally, you are what? You are traumatized. I told us the testimony or the story of a woman, an investor, who lost the husband, lost the first daughter, and lost the son at the age of 53. And she herself was 70 something. Praise the Lord. And that was the only child remaining. Amen, somebody. Brethren, things like this brings depression. Brings what? And when, depression, how do you know depression? When you get to a stage in your life and you ask yourself, why am I living? What am I living for? In other words, the pressure push you to begin to ask for debt. Listen to me, sir. I am praying for somebody here today. Spirit of depression will never knock at your door. <laughs> Brethren, depression can make you to lose all that you are and all that you have. And if you don't believe me, Go and study the story of Elijah. After that, Elijah had dealt with the prophet of Baal in that first king chapter 18. Plotter them. Call down fire. Amen, somebody. Amen, somebody. When he had the threat of Jezebel, Spirit of depression grip Elijah. Amen. And so he said to God, He said, I am not worth living. Hello. That is not what? That is not worth living. And you know what? That was the day Elijah lost his ministry. Can I pray for you, sir? Every arrow of depression back to sender. 
It was the pressure that made the widow of Sarah in 2 Kings chapter 17 to say to Elijah, I have only my last meal that I will eat with my son and die. Depression. Brethren, why am I emphasizing on this depression? We are in a critical time in this nation. We are a lot of things are happening and many are just thinking so many things. I get the story of the lady that was rescued on Todd Mellon Bridge that want to take her life. We've had several ladies that have jumped into the river in Lagos. Why? Depression. They are emotionally traumatized. That widow of Nain was under depression. The Bible says, and a lot of people were around her. To do what? To mourn with her. To sympathize with her. To pity her. Stand on your feet. God of all possibility will take depression away from you. Depression and sorrow, they go together. God will deliver you from sorrow. If you are saying amen, say it loud and clear. If you read that, Exodus 3, verse 7, and, 8, and the Lord said, I have surely seen the affliction of my people, which are in Egypt. I have heard their cry by the reason of their taskmaster, for I know their sorrow. I know their depression. Amen? He said, and I am come down to deliver them out of the hand of the Egyptian. Lift up your two hands. Brethren, I beg you, sir, please pray this prayer with all your heart. Pray what? Depression can come in many ways. Cry to God and say, Father, in any way I am depressed. Arise now by your power. Deliver me now. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God? Lord, deliver me from the spirit of depression. Ah, Malika Kutaya Lala. Barakuta Gaze Katon Dalale. Kari Protololo. Gazinde Lele Kakuta Yendale. Maraba Baba 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 in Jesus mighty name we are praying lift up your hands and say father anything that will bring depression to my life anything that will bring depression to my children oh God my father destroy them now can you go ahead and talk to the almighty God you will not know depression masakuta labanda Hey, Kakuta Gaziande, Barigaga, and Ekanta, with the God of all possibility, deliver you from all depression. You will not be depressed. You will not be emotionally traumatized. Karika to Gaza, Baroba Tega Sindali. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Brethren, if you see those who have depression, they lack joy. They lack what? They don't know joy. No more regular joy. And I pray for you, sir. All the days of your life, you will never lack joy. Lift up your toe and say, Father, fill my life with joy. Fill my home, my family with joy. Let me not lack joy. Can you go ahead and pray that prayer for yourself? That you will never lack joy. You will never lack joy. God will fill you with joy, with joy, with joy, with joy. Every day. Thank you, mighty Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Because of time, be seated for a minute. Beloved, an encounter with the God of all possibility delivered the young man from the power of untimely death. Hello? The Bible says, He said, The Lord shall satisfy thee with what? Long life. 
But in the case of this young boy, at a prime age, his son said, Can I pray for one person one more time? Your son will not set in the noon. Oh, only one person know what I'm talking about. The son of your children will not set in the noon. That you are standing here this morning. As the Almighty God touch you, you shall be delivered from the power of untimely death. With long life shall the Lord satisfy thee. You will not die but live. You will not cast your younger. Lift up your two hands to heaven and cry loud and cry and say, Father, say, Father, let the number of my days be fulfilled. Let the number of the days of my children be fulfilled. Deliver me and my household from untimely death. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God? Parema te kasanda li baba. Hey, kakuta ba ye kakuta li ya. Rakaka ba le gade kasanda li mama. Oh, masika tale brande kasanda li. Kaka ba 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 ba. Rapote gazita le mama kasanda li. Sali gaga 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 gaga. Kakute Kasianda. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Lift up your two and say, Father, deliver me from arrows of death. Deliver all my children from the arrows of death. Deliver every member of my household from the arrows of death. Every arrow of death. Fired at me. What are you waiting for? Backfire by fire. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God? Can report to Gazandali. Oh, Marie, Mama, Cassiandale. Kaka, 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 Kaka. Mashe, Telele. Ah, Mare, Baba, Baba, Baba. Santa, la, 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 la. Rokoto, Kabashiandala, la. Kakuta la brade kasianda la. Sale gaga 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 gaga. Kapa la brade kasianda le. Setelele kasunta le mama. Thank you, my dear Father. In Jesus, my name, we are praying. You will take one more prayer. And then we're going to the laying on hands so that we can close on time. But then look at me, sir. That faithful day. That what? That faithful day. The Almighty God put laughter in her mouth. But then, when laugh have you laughed? I mean, when last has something happened to you that you laugh? I thought you will laugh. I thought you will laugh. You see now, you cannot even you cannot even practice it. <laughs> I said, let somebody laugh. Because the Bible says to me that the day Abraham and Sarah had an encounter their family laugh not only did the family laugh they are said in that genesis and say even though that here we do all laugh with me brethren laughter is contagious i stand upon this altar today things that will make me to laugh with you whether they want it or not, whether they like it or not, as the Almighty God touch you today, ah, that thing will happen. I don't know what you are believing God for. I don't know what you are trusting God for. But you are about to encounter the God of all possibility. 
you shall laugh. Say, Father, I want to laugh. I want men to laugh with me. Put laughter in my mouth. Can you go ahead and talk to the Almighty God? Oh. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Yes, we want to do laying our hand. I don't want you to come. You understand what I'm saying? I want you to come with a joyful heart. Because I decree the touch you are about to, to, to receive is to activate laughter in your life. So, whatever that needs to leave your body for you to laugh, we leave. Whatever you need to receive to laugh, you will receive. So quiet, we are going to have a celebration song. Brother, if you are coming forward and you are not laughing and you are not celebrating, I will not lay hand on you. Because this money, brother, the ridiculous produce the miraculous. You are you know when you are coming this morning, some of you are just like this. Eh? This God of all possibility, Pastor Apostle is talking about. When will he do my own? He has done it already. I say he has done it already. In healing, he's doing it. In breakthrough, he's doing it. In promotion, he's doing it. In lifting, he's doing it. You believe it? Say it louder, amen. So, 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 don't just come and just stand like this. If you come and stand like this, I will also pass you like this. Amen. Because we want to do transferring of spirit of joy. Spirit of heaviness must leave you alone. Joy attract joy. Laughter attract laughter. Tell your neighbor, laugh with me. Uh, you are asking your neighbor to laugh with you and you are not laughing. How can you be telling your neighbor to laugh with you and you are not laughing? Tell your neighbor, laugh with me. Kapa Santa Labrani. Zabale Gazunta Le Kakuta. Yen de Le Katu Gaziana Le Bakusandala. There's going to be a pouring of the spirit of joy. And that will attract your blessing. Attract your breakthrough. Attract your promotion. Over to you, choir. No man can see the end of your glory. Ah. As you are coming, just come with your offering at once and drop your offering. No man can see the end of your glory. No man can know the end of your power. No man can know the end of your Oh, 
Just la, 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 makakabaya, yekato gazakata, rakakaga. As you are laughing, impossibility is becoming possible. As you are laughing, healing is taking place. As you are laughing, doors are opening, doors are opening, doors are opening, doors are opening. As you are laughing, blessings are flowing. Receive it, 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 receive it. Happiness is gone, happiness is gone, depression is gone. In the name of Jesus, Marakataya Baba, Rakata la bashiana la, rekete kete gazunda, bakuta gaziana, boroko toga, ye kakuta yaba, masotelo, gazekete, kakuta yaba baba, gare gaziana, mara pato gazi, lekete kete kete, ba yoko to, anda la bakuta, gabra gada gara, rekete gazunda, mama mama mama, jebolo gaziana, masiene le boshiana. Thank you, Father. Lift up your hands. Oh, my dad is in the house. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Receive a direct touch from the crown of your head. <laughs> That's it. That's it. To the tips of your toe, let it flow. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. The cancel of the enemy. I cancel now in the name of Jesus. Doors of rejoicings are open. Doors of lotters are open. Go and rejoice. Go and celebrate. They shall love with you. In the name of God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit. May the Almighty God accept your offering. Bless you richly. And in that name that's above every other name. Financial breakthroughs that will make you laugh. The doors are open. Poverty is eliminated. Poverty
permanently in our lives in that about Jesus and so shall it be you know what God the Father God the Son God the Holy Spirit we don't send together for Jesus see you tomorrow morning we continue from where we start don't forget there will be a clinic in the evening and the almighty God will make you to continue to laugh the grace